what's good, y'all? It's your boy Chosen One with two guns repping that EMZ bitch TV. Stand back. Fucking Floyd Mayweather gas. Gay ass over here talking about. I don't follow motherfuckers. Don't you know? I'm not a follower, man. I'm going to do what the fuck I want. That shit ain't got nothing to do with me. Man, if you don't shut your gay, corny ass out of here, that's why everybody ripping your dumb ass, bro. Like, bro, you you a big ass, like, public figure out here, bro. Like, motherfuckers really look up to you, bro. Not me, but a lot of people do, man. A lot of kids, a lot of motherfuckers. You can't just be coming out here talking about, that ain't got nothing to do with me. If they're disrespecting black people, uh, I don't know nothing about that, you know what I'm saying? I'm not no followers. Just because you start rocking Gucci and this guy start rocking Gucci, I'm not going to start rocking Gucci. You know why they went up to him? You know why they went up to him and asked him that shit? Because they knew he was going to say some dumb shit like that. They, they knew, bro. Who was it? TMZ? I don't know who the fuck it was that ran up on them in front of the Gucci store. But they did that shit because they knew. They knew he was going to say some dumb shit. Y'all don't remember Y'all don't remember when, uh, when was it? Young Thug, they had asked Young Thug some type of question. This was like, this was like when Young Thug had, had like popped off and shit. I think they had asked him something about, I don't know, some shit with the race and shit that was happening or something like that. This motherfucker was talking about jewelry and shit like that. That shit was funny as hell. And I'm like, and I'm like, but they doing that on purpose, you know what I'm saying? They they interview these rich ass people that don't got, you know, a half of a brain. You know, cause they know, they know they're gonna say some dumb, corny, crazy shit that's gonna give you that people gonna talk about it. Like look, every day more and more people are getting on Floyd. You know what I mean? There was only in the beginning there was only like a few cats that was that was talking shit to Floyd because of what he said. Now it's like a gang of motherfuckers. You know what I mean? But uh, 50 Cent is going the hardest. Like 50 Cent put up a post with, with Floyd Mayweather face. You could just see from the neck up. And he, and he put like that that black, you know, that black Gucci man that they were trying to sell that covered the mouth. Well, he, he, he uploaded a pic of Floyd Mayweather with that mask on. Bro, that shit look funny as hell, bro. That shit got like, I don't know how many views already on that fucking post, but that shit, I saw that shit, I was like, bro, that shit funny as hell. But that's what he get, bro. That's what he get because that's how you looking like right now. Floyd Mayweather's looking like a clown, bro, like a straight clown. Niggas don't give a fuck about money. You know what I mean? Not everybody cares about money. There's people out there that don't give a fuck how, mu how much money you got. Only people that care about how much money Floyd got is the broke motherfuckers. But niggas like 50 Cent that got money, Niggas like T.I. that got money. These, the, you know what I'm saying? These OGs, Gucci man, and all these motherfuckers, niggas that really, really got money. You feel me? They ain't about to be on no dumb shit. Still talking about, oh, I'm still rocking Gucci, this and that. No, man, these niggas, they don't care a fuck about that. You know what I mean? They, they don't gotta, they don't gotta, uh, they don't gotta ride another man dick and, and, and cloud chase or whatever the fuck it is. You feel me? That's why niggas like 50 Cent is getting at him so hard. 50 Cent got money. You know, he, 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 he's not like he's looking for clout. 50 Cent don't need no damn clout. 50 Cent is 50 Cent, nigga. If, if you want clout, tag your name next to 50 Cent. 50 Cent ain't looking for no damn clout. You feel me? Uh, anything 50 Cent posts is because that's how he's feeling, and it is what it is. But he's not looking for nothing, bro. He's not looking for no clout. He's not looking for nothing, nothing. So him getting out Floyd, man, that shit funny as hell, but... What can I say, man? This nigga done said some dumb shit, bro. You feel me? Like, if, if I was Floyd, I would have been like, I just would have said something different. I don't know how I would have said it, but I would have been prepared because I would have been like, all right, these niggas going to catch me out here one day and they're going to ask me this question about this Gucci shit since I be buying Gucci all the damn time. They're going to come. You got to think about it. It's not only Gucci. Gucci ain't the only main name brand. Bro, how about Fendi? How about Ferragamo? How about Givenchy? You got like a thousand other name brands that are out there that is just like Gucci, but cost even more than Gucci. But you know what it is? It's just the name Gucci. You feel me? It's just the name. Floyd Mayweather ain't about to let that name go out of his life because of a few rappers that are upset because of that monkey face thing. He's not about to stop doing that because that nigga cocky as hell. You got to remember, Floyd Mayweather is one of the cockiest dudes on this planet, bro. 
he's one of the cockiest niggas, and does he got the right to be cocky? I mean, he kind of do, bro. Think about it. That motherfucker haven't lost a fight yet. He haven't lost. So, yeah, you got a right to be cocky, nigga. You haven't lost a fight, you know? But it's a different type of way of cockiness, you feel me? His cockiness is kind of corny, you know what I mean? Like, like we all know you got money. Everybody know you got money. Everybody know you got a watch that's one watch is 15 million. Everybody know that, you know? But the, the, the thing is, like, to keep constantly showing money on IG, like, he be acting like he a broke rapper that just made it, you feel me? But I know what he's doing. I know what he's doing, though. He's doing this for the bitches. Because Floyd Mayweather knows that bitches love money. And the more money you show, the more bitches going to be on you. You feel me? They could know that you're rich. They could know it. But one thing is knowing and one thing is seeing it with your own eyes. If a bitch is scrolling, if a bitch is scrolling down her timeline on IG, right? And she happened to scroll by fucking Floyd Mayweather shit. And this nigga got a stack of money. He got, let's say he got a fucking uh, a bedroom, right? One bedroom. Right, with nothing in it but stacks of money, just stand up like that one kingpin that got that got caught somewhere, and they took pictures and shit of the raid, and this nigga had stacks of money in rooms, like literally nothing in the room but stacks of money. You know what I mean? He'll do some. A uh, chick will be scrolling down the timeline. She'll see some shit like that, bro. That bitch gonna get wet. She gonna get wet, bro. She gonna get moist. She gonna be drowning in the ocean, nigga. That's how. That's how all she gonna be, bro. When women see that money like that, bro, that money, bro. Women, I'm telling you, bro. Oh my God, these bitches will do anything, anything for you when they see that money, anything, anything, bro. They will do anything, especially that type of money like 50 got. So 50 ain't cloud chasing. That's how he feel, you feel me? He feel like champ fucking up and then says some dumb shit. I'm not a follower. You know what I'm saying? Because he, he trying to look like he don't follow niggas. Like he the man, and, and it is what it is. And he the man, he don't got to follow nobody. It is what it is. You could you could have your opinion. It's just, it's a certain way you got to talk about shit. You feel me? And especially a person like like Floyd, you know? He, he's, he, you know, he's very known, man. This nigga popular, bro, you know? Undefeated boxer, all this shit. Rich as fuck, you feel me? People actually look up to this guy and is gonna pay attention to the shit he say. And if he's saying some shit, a lot of people gonna believe what he's saying. A lot of people right now probably like, yeah, he right. You know what I'm saying? They, they, I mean, they they apologize. They, they did apologize. I mean, they did they did acknowledge that they were wrong. I guess we could still buy Gucci. You know, everybody else is racist anyway. And that's it. Before you know it. Just because of Floyd Mayweather, you got 30% of the black people and the Spanish people and all types of races in America, at least probably 30, 20 to 30% still fucking with Gucci because Floyd Mayweather said it's okay. Shit like that, bro. Shit like that. You feel me? And that's why, the, and that's why niggas get mad like 50 Cent. They got to blame his ass. You feel me? Now, I'm not sure about T.I. though, but before I got on his live, I was scrolling and I saw some shit about T.I., but I'm not 100% sure about that, so I'm not going to talk about that. But I, I don't talk about shit that I really don't know. You feel me? But uh, I think, I think T.I. said some shit about Floyd. I think, I think, I think he did. But if he did, you know I'm going to talk about it, gang. You feel me? I'm definitely going to bring that up, but I think he definitely did. And you know T.I., T.I. is an intelligent man. That nigga is smart. He is not no dummy. That nigga know what he talking about. And people really listen to T.I. People really, really, really listen to T.I. Way more people listen to T.I. than Floyd, I'll tell you that. Way more people do. Way more. So if, if T.I. did say something to Floyd, I'm very, I'm kind of interested right now to talking about, I want to see what the hell he said. Because this shit about to get real good. I'm telling you guys. This shit gonna get real, real good. Hockey, you can't push or you out. It's gonna get real good and spicy. But, gang, I'm all at y'all, man. Cause I gotta smoke and there's kids and everybody around this motherfucker. Excuse me. Gang.